Well, that was a fun night last night. <laughs> what was? Chutney Queens. It's a, it's a gay Asian nightclub, or Gaysian, as the indigenous like to say. <laughs> Why the hell are you telling me that? I think Paul might be secretly gay. Well, because the LGBTQIAPK is our theme for this Diversity Weeks news. What the hell is that? The LGBTQIAPK. What is it? What the hell does it mean? Lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, queer, intersex, asexual, polyamorous and kink. Who is writing the question? How can I prove I'm not gay? Do you want me to grab your sister or your bits and just fuck her right now? Go for it. Why don't they just call it NS? Not straight? Because the world's a lot more colourful than just black and white. My drag queen friends tell me that I make them feel more feminine and shapely and womanly. Okay, so let me get this straight. <laughs> 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 so there's a place in London, yeah? A club where Javid takes Ahmed up the alley. Gay people make me feel fine. I feel fine. They don't make me feel fine. I don't feel fine when I look at gay people or like... If I meet a gay person, I don't really care. It's not really a, it's not really a big thing if they're kufar, dickhead people. But just what they want to do, they're going to go to hell and burn. It's not, I don't really have anything against it, it's fine, it's cool. There's a lot of uh, girls that um, go there. Yeah, well, no offence, yeah, but they must be like dogs. Pardon? Like, fag hags, isn't it? That's what they call them. Girls who hang around the gay people because they want to get the attention and be called babe. And like, they can't otherwise sleep in the guy's bed. I have a lot of gay friends and none of them call me babe or sleep in my bed. I can see why, Pina. Mina. It's Mina. Mina. Alright, keep a timpex in. <clears throat> Look, Paul, I think I should let you know that I've got the um, creator of Chutney Queens in for an interview. What, the club where them reject girls go? I'll have you know that there are a lot of hot straight girls that go there because they're sick and tired of being hit on by drunk perverts and straight bars. Really? So uh, this geezer guy, he can maybe like get me free entry or something, yeah? Careful on the dosage. I've seen guys go from Randy Savage to RuPaul real quick. What, it's gonna make me gay? Oh, not unless oh. you already are, honey. So suddenly, not only am I not Alex, I'm Gopal, but I'm also Gopal who is gay. Gay? And I'm Gopal? I'm gay pal. Take this and say kuda hafez to your performance anxiety. I was in quality food and I wanted to make aloo gobi. There was one potato left, but obviously Auntie G had it. So I grabbed it from her, from her trolley and then she got angry, so I chucked it at her head. Uh, oh no, that was GBH. Nothing's happening. Oh my god, guys. Today's special guest is cancelled. This is worse than Brexit. Ugh. I think you might want to sit down. I have a duty to all my LGBT STD. VHS brothers and sisters out there do oh, I'm so fired. Uh, uh, stand by for broadcast. Um, in uh, three, what, what do you do? two, one, action. Careful with the fucking set, you stupid bitch! Oh, oh shit, my mic's on. Catch me outside! How about that? <laughs> Hello, yes, and uh, welcome today to Paul Talks. Um, where I'm going to be uh, speaking about um, uh, e eating out. Meow! <laughs> Who's a pretty pussy then? <laughs> yeah. Meow! <laughs> and, as you, and as you can see, today's guest uh, is, is Tina. Um, she's a famous uh, transsexual um, from London's Chutney Queens. She was like Cara Delevingne in the Suicide Squad. Hey boy, cover my samosa with your chutney. I looked at her TV, there was nothing that said like circus act or zoo animal. <laughs> Oh. Mm. Oh. 
Taking a short break, guys. I try to understand when colleagues are not feeling well because they are human beings and I want to just make sure they are okay, like physically, mentally, and I don't want to like pressure them to keep working. Quick Skype. Um Paul, I had the worst nightmare. <laughs> Paul, give me your lighter. I already did, but I can't bring myself to say where you put it. It was stress. Intense, emotional stress. No, it wasn't. You took that gay drug? What gay drug? Gopal was saying like how we had sex for days, yeah, because he drank this thing. So he gave me some and he put it in his bottle. And anyway, you came and you drank the bottle. I was high on GHP. Paula could have died. Well, you will when the whole world sees that. <laughs> no chance. It's already gone live on broadcast. What? No, no way, no way. Well, if our stats are anything to go by, it will just be the 12 from the crew and maybe, maybe, Go pal's mum. How many views? 10,000. Yeah, it's probably best that we just like uh, delete it and get it. We don't, we don't give the wrong impression to... We... Maybe you're right. We couldn't show our love till the LGBTQ... IAPK. Oh, Paul. You did learn something. Uh, maybe my heightened euphoria and my lowered inhibitions and my drowsiness acted like a catalyst no. for you to learn. You were just gay. Paul? Yeah. I think I found your lighter. That's why people shouldn't do drugs. Very healthy canteen, popcorn, skinny, like uh, the white girls, 97 calories, good for the uh, like immune system, different flavors for everyone because not everyone likes the same thing. And that's what you have to remember about like people in society, grass like, from like the Amazon rainforest and that, plants and everything like that, yeah, fresh. Our motto in life, grab and go. Oh no, we're, we're filming for my show. That's it. Yeah, yeah, I'll put, I'll put it back, Donnie. Yes, I'll, I'll just, uh, yeah. Hey, what are you doing? You haven't connected with us on social media yet?